We'll call the meeting to order at approximately 435, January 22nd. This is the meeting of the Oxford Area Cable Communications Commission board meeting and at the Oxford Township offices. And if we could stand and get our respects to the flag. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Um, Terry, are you gonna take notes? Sure. For, okay, yep. can you do the roll, do roll call, call? Yep. Ed Hunwick, absent with notice. Catherine Colvin. Here. Maureen Helmuth, absent with notice. Karen Geibel. Here. John Hawkins. Here. All present. Okay. Uh, approval of the agenda. I'll make a motion to approve the agenda as presented. I'll second. Okay, it's been motioned and supported. Although, we just need a, all those in favor, right? Yep. All those in favor? Aye. 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 Any opposed? Okay, that carries. Uh, public comments not on the agenda. Bueller, <laughs> Bueller. <laughs> nope. <laughs> nope. <laughs> Nothing. Okay, um, and then we have item number six is the minutes, approval of the meeting minutes from December 18th, 2023 at pages two and three of the doc, um, packet. Yeah, I'd like to approve the minutes of the OEC meeting December 18th, 2023. I'll as written. I'll support. Okay, it's been motioned and supported. Um, all those in favor? Aye. 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 Any opposed? And that passes. Item number seven is the bill review. Um, 7A is the 2023 expense revenue bill run dated 12 18 of 23. And then there's also the 2024 expense revenue bill run dated 1 1 of 24. You want to do those separately? Yeah, they're two do we separate need to do amount. them separate? They're two separate yeah. amounts. Okay, so for the, for 7A, then the, I think the amount is on, it's on pages four to six. Five. I have totals on five. Yeah, with the approval, with the total amounts on page five. The Anybody first one is 9,335.01. Okay, I'll make a motion to approve the expenses for, as of 12, 28, 23, in the amount of $9,335.01. I'll second. Is there any discussion on the bills? Anybody? Since it's us three, <laughs> um, then we need a roll call, please. Yes. Um, Karen Geibel? Yes. John Hawkins? Yes. Catherine Colvin? Yes. Okay, so that carries. Uh, then 7B is the 2024 expense revenue bill run for approval for dated 1124. That's at pages 7 through 9 with the total amount at page 8. 2605. I'll make oh. a motion to approve the expenses as a for 1 1 2024 in the amount of uh, $8,926.05. I'll second. Uh, you're reading from what? I have a different amount. Page, it's page it's eight. eight. It's 8,92605. The, the number below that? Is that what you're looking at? The oh, 80... I thought Catherine said something different than 89.2605. Oh. Did you? No, that's no, what she said. That. Oh, sorry. It's my no, hearing. No worries. <laughs> okay. Then I don't have any questions. Anybody else have any questions or comments about the bill run? Need a roll call for that, right? Yep. Then we need a roll call, please. John Hawkins? Yep. Uh, Catherine Colvin? Yes. And Karen Geibel? Yes. Okay. So that passes. Okay. Item number 7C is the 2023 year-to-date revenue and expense report. That's at pages 10 and 11. Can we do C and D together? Mm -hmm. Yeah, and then, okay, then 7D is also the uh, dis general ledger, is that it? Yep. Yep. The invoice general ledger distribution report for December of 2023 at pages 12 to 13. I'll make a motion to receive and file um, items 7, C, and D on the agenda. Second. Okay. And since it's us three, there's no discussion, I'm sure. So um, it's been motioned and seconded. All those in favor? Aye. 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 Any opposed? Okay, and that carries. All right. Item number 8A is the Michigan Class Investment 
dated 12 31 23 it's at page 14 of the packet and that looks like it's in the amount of 232 7 11 50 and this is just a receiving file i think yep we could also do probably seven or i'm sorry 8b which is the Oakland County Investment Pool, which is dated 1324, mm -hmm. page 15, and that always carries a small amount for 6896. It's just a receiving file. Yep. I'll make a motion to receive and file um, the items in agenda items 8A and B. I'll second. Okay. Uh, all those in favor? Aye. 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 Any opposed? Okay, and that carries. Moving right along, um, item 8C is the status on House Bill 4965. Um, Terry? Yeah, so I heard today that it's um, still on the floor in the Senate and it's actively being looked at, um, which means it, from what I'm hearing, um, there's a couple people not in favor of it and they're pretty influential, so that's a positive thing. Um, what we want is just to renegotiate it, just, mm -hmm. you know, to reword it. So, um, so far, it's encouraging. Yeah, mm -hmm. I looked it up yesterday to see what the status was because I hadn't heard anything. I figured you would have sent an email if something popped. But. Yeah, right, right. <laughs> I've been bugging um, the manager in Lake Orion. He's got his finger on the pulse of it right now. So I called him, and he said right now they're just looking at it. So is that just active discussion, like, ongoing? Like, they just keep... Yeah. Hmm. And they're actually discussing things with um, community groups, which is really good to hear, that the commission is listening to community groups. Mm -hmm. So okay. I'm encouraged by okay. that. Well, no news is good news for now. Exactly. Know. Yeah. Did you talk to uh, Ruth Johnson? Um, she's not in favor of it at all now. Okay, good. Yeah, she's she on the right side of that one. Yep. Okay. Yeah. Well, I'm sure you'll keep us posted. I will. Definitely. Yep. Okay. Um, then item nine is unfinished business and it's discussion of the next um, committee meeting date, mm -hmm. which would have been February 26th, but you wanted to propose maybe moving that? Yeah. Um, so Ed suggested if we <clears throat> didn't have much on the agenda that maybe we could just not meet in February. Um, Mo doesn't know that sh whether she can meet or not, and I am planning on being out of town for my mother-in-law's memorial service, um, and that would be that day. <laughs> okay. That's the weekend that they want to have it. What do we want to do? Just not like... have it. If I, I would say, if something comes up that's imperative that we meet, we could hold a special meeting if nothing else. Okay, so you'll just communicate through email and then we'll just add the meeting if we had to? Mm -hmm. Yep. Okay. Yeah, that's fine with me. Yeah. John? Yeah. Is that good? Do we need a motion or yes. anything? Yes. Um, I'll make a motion to um, cancel the February 26, 2024 meeting. I'll second. Okay, it's been motioned and supported. All those in favor? Aye. 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 Any opposed? Okay, that carries. I'll just give you a heads up that the week of March, the, the March 25th hearing date, I, I probably will be on spring break. So oh, yeah. just FYI, it's early this year. So I didn't realize that, but. Well, I'll try not to put anything on the agenda then that we need a full quorum. Oh, I for mean, March 25th, uh, yeah. Right, for yeah. a um, super quorum. Super quorum, okay. Yeah. Just heads up on that. Okay, thanks. Okay, um, so then we're on to item 10A, new business established committee for renewal of the OACCC interlocal agreement. It expires on 2025. Right. I don't know if you want to establish that right now or just talk about it, um, but I think that th there's some things that we could look at on this interlocal agreement, and we certainly need to pay attention. We have one year if we want to make any changes, and we'd have to have legal language, etc. at that point. Um. So when was this, I know you, you attached a copy of the old agreement. This That's was the current one. Oh, the current one, I'm sorry. And this was signed back in 2015. Uh -huh. So you had legal counsel like helping with this at that time? Is that, or did you even need it? Or? They did. It was not 
we didn't have legal representative at that time, um, but they borrowed a legal representative from the township. Okay. So did you have a committee last time that helped on this? When? I don't think they did. Meaning our committee? I think they just signed it. Oh. The same interlocal that's been going on. Since 1980, I found out, is when um, this was formed. Really? So it's 40 years old? Yeah. Isn't that something? <laughs> mm -hmm. should probably be looked at. 43, yeah. Um, so you're suggesting maybe we form a small committee to yeah. start mm -hmm. some Just kind of discussion it, about yeah. this, looking at it and mm -hmm. seeing if there's anything. Mm -hmm. right. And at that time, um, you might want to consider inviting Mike Watsa, who is an attorney, and he's the foremost authority of public access, um, television, contracts, et cetera, in the United States, from what I hear. But he certainly is in Michigan. Um, he does charge three fifty an hour. And he emailed me last year saying he would do that. He would charge us three fifty an hour and mileage. And he's in Ann Arbor. Okay. But he'd be the guy I would recommend, or we could um, Ed has a neighbor that's an attorney that he that she said she would be willing to work with us as well. So that's something else we really would need to discuss in the next meeting or two. Hmm. Okay. Well, it makes sense to heads up. That's all yeah. I want you guys to have right now. Okay. Yep. I think it makes sense to form some kind of little committee, even if it's just a couple people. It hurt. You know, just one Saturday looking at it, or, or a couple couple more eyes to it. I've read it over and over again and I probably am missing stuff that I that somebody else might see. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I mean it doesn't look too involved. But... It's not. It's pretty simple. Okay. All right. So maybe we'll just table that for add it to the agenda next okay. time we meet so that Put we it in I mean do you, I'm, I'm I guess I'm suggesting I yeah, I would that... I would suggest that as well. Yeah. Okay. So you could make that a motion. Okay, so I'll make a motion to just table the establishment of a committee for the renewal of the interlocal agreement till till the next meeting that we have, whenever that is. I'll second. Okay, all those in favor? Aye. 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 Any opposed? Okay, that carries. Okay. All right, so then number 11 is the manager's okay. report. I, I don't know if you have one down there. It's pretty short. Um, we hired another crew member to cover meetings at night. We couple times have ended up short and actually couldn't cover I can't remember what meeting but we couldn't cover a meeting because we didn't have enough um, evening people so we hired another one um, I will be hosting the food drive with Ian Locke uh, the manager of Lake Orion and that is for Oxford Orion fish they do it every year I'm hosting two days with him and that's um, introing programming and the programming that they're going to use for those two days are all of our programming. So I've sent them 10 hours worth, or maybe even more, 12 hours worth of programming. So people in Lake Orion are gonna see what we're doing here, which um, our programming is really superior, I think, to other public access television stations. Um, so that's gonna be fun, and I will also be interviewing the DDA director so she can let everybody in Lake Orion know how they're working together it's stronger together, I think. Is that stronger together? It? Yes, but yeah, the DDA. The, did they hire a new DDA director? Because Molly left. I know. Well, she's going to talk about everything that we've done in the last year. Oh, okay. <laughs> and they're hoping to do more <laughs> in Lake Orion. That's right. Molly did leave. Um, let's see. Oh, and I'll be taking time off in February. And then I just told you about HB forty nine sixty five, and that's it. What were the dates of the food drive that you're? That you're covering the oh, it's I was just the, curious. the week of the sixth February. Um, early mm -hmm. February. Yep. Hang on. Uh, I'm gonna be there the sixth. Yep. It's the week of the sixth, so it's one week. February fifth through the ninth mm -hmm. is their food drive, and they hope to raise ten thousand dollars this year. So I've um, put out a PSA looking for sponsors in this community. So if you know anybody that might want to sponsor it, let me know. Okay. Sounds good. That's it. Okay. All done. right. Um, 
The next item is committee reports. I guess technical committee's Ed, and he's not here. Mm -hmm. I haven't met. And personnel committee, there's really nothing happening. Right. That's me and Mo. Um, commissioner's comments. Catherine, anything? Happy New Year. John? <laughs> okay, I don't have anything either. Public comments, since we flew through this. <laughs> Bueller, Bueller. Okay. All right, then that's it. Somebody want to move for an adjournment? I'll make a motion to adjourn. I'll second. Okay. Uh, all those in favor? Aye. 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 Any opposed? That carries. Okay. Beautiful. All those opposed?